Hey guys, it's Denise here and welcome back to another video and thank you so much for watching and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Um, so we're going to get straight into this video. As you can see, it's going to be an unboxing of my nail boxy and this box is actually from the month of November. I know we're already what, almost in February. I actually get these boxes every month, but I'm obviously a little bit backed up. So I do have my box for November, December, and January sitting there waiting for me to actually open it because I haven't opened them just yet. So I'm gonna get to them eventually, I promise. So this box is from November. They actually are gonna focus on a, I think the product is from Lisa Khan. I have never heard of them. And then that's the good thing about this nail subscription. If you guys haven't heard about Nail Boxy, it is a monthly subscription. I do pay $29.99 a month to get a box every month with goodies inside. Um, I think it's about five to 10 products that come in the box that of you know different brands, different companies that you can try out. And I think it's a good thing because you get to try and hear about new companies and stuff like that and see if you like their their products or not and so on so let's go ahead and get started like i said i've never heard of the company before so this is my first time all right so i'm opening it up and this is what we have inside so i'm just going to take everything out so we can go ahead and so because this is so noisy so you're not going to be able to hear all of me so i'm going to just take everything out Okay, so I got everything out, and the first thing that I see is this Lisa Khan 3D Magic Gel. So let me see what this is about. So this is a three, the 3D Magic Gel. It's thick, and it's pigmented paint gel for 3D line work and hand-painted art. So it looks like it's going to be a random color. And I'm actually just reading off the description from the website because I want to make sure that I give you guys the right information. And it's not open so let me go ahead and open it to see what color i got because it doesn't say but it's 10 mls so it, i mean it's a pretty good size it's not that big but let's see let me try and open it all right so i went ahead and opened it and the color is black and i'm just gonna grab it with this little pincher but it looks like it's a thick consistency so i think it's gonna be a good a good gel for that nail art they were uh, mentioning so that's what we have here so this is paint gel and um i did go on their um instagram page which if you guys want to check them out it's lisa con so it's l-i-s-a-k-o-n underscore product it looks like they sell their stuff off of um etsy and etsy shop so they have like gel polishes art glue stickers drill bits brushes and my lamp so they sell all that good stuff on there um let's see what else is this so this is chrome liner gel this is 8 ml so let's see what this is so the chrome liner gel okay so the chrome liner just a glitter metallic chrome painting gel so it's another random color so let me go try and open this one too it's like a silvery chrome color and also it has a pretty thick consistency it looks like so that'll also be good so let me cover this back up and if you guys heard of lisa khan if you guys have tried out their products let me know what you guys think about them because i haven't personally ever heard of them until now and then we have these little flowers here from what's veronica or veronica's shop Oops, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. Let me see. It's Veronique's shop. If I'm butchering that, I'm so sorry, but it's just little dried up flowers, super cute. All right, the next thing that we have is Lisa Khan Shimmer Top Coat. So let's see, look at this. So this is a beautiful shimmer top coat to use over gel polish, acrylic, or hard gel. Um, so, of course, you apply a thin coat, avoid the cuticle, and you can cure for two minutes. So, oh, look at this one. If I, and actually, I've been wanting a top coat with, like, glitter. And this is going to be super cool. So, I have my nail here already painted, so let's take a look. Oh, look at that. 
I love this. It's so shimmery. Look at that. It's so pretty. So I'm definitely going to have to try this. I hope you guys can see the little shimmer. All right. And their bottles are super cute. They're all black with the white print on them. Super cute. Okay, so the next thing that we got here is just the base gel. So let's see. And this bottle is also, this is a 10 ml bottle. So it's a strong base coat for gel overlay. And you can also apply a thin coat of this and cure. So it's just base gel. All right, let's move on to the next one. So the next one is a tangerine. I think this is a gel polish. Yep, so it's a gel polish, random color. So it's also 10 mLs. It has a creamy consistency and full coverage. All right, so it says that for the perfect result, use Lisa Con rubber base and Lisa Con super shine coat. So let's see what color we got. Ooh, well, duh, hello, tangerine. It's right here. <laughs> Guys, I can really be like, so out in space, my brain, I don't know. But look at this, this is a really pretty color. Oh, it's perfect for summer too, super bright. So that's a pretty color. All right, and then the last thing that we have, it's from the Nail Candy Shop, and it says Christmas in Candyland. So it's just a holiday mix, and I'm not gonna open it because I don't want glitter all over the place, but it's pink with little um, purple glitters and stuff like that. So it's super cute. So yeah, that's all we got in the box. Again, Nailboxy, it's a monthly subscription for $29.99. And you can always buy their past boxes as well. That's if they still have them available in stock. But I've had Nailboxy for almost a year now. So, and I haven't been disappointed yet. And like I said, I hear about products that I've never heard before and I get to try them and see if I like them and see if I want to continue the, to buy their products and stuff like that. So Lisa Khan is one of them that I never heard about. So yeah, if you guys are definitely interested, go check them out. You don't have to like fully commit. You can always just buy the box that you're interested in. Again, if they're available, but yeah, that's what came in the month of November. I know we're almost in February, so I will get to my December box as well in my January box, but let me know if you guys have tried the products. If not, um, you can always give them a try as well if you get their box. So yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye!